My name is Nora and I'm going to read Angelina's Ballet Class, written by Katherine Hallberg, illustrations by Kellen Craig. Angelina's Ballet Class. Angelina is very excited. She's going to Miss Willie's ballet class today. She packs her pink tutu and two pink slippers in her ballet bag and off she goes. In the dressing room, Angelina meets her friends. They love ballet class too. Angelina ties Alice's ribbons and Alice fixes Angelina's bow. In her tutu and slippers, Angelina feels as white as a feather. She can't wait to start dancing. Good morning, Miss Lily, the ballerinas greet their teacher. Angelina twirls around the dance studio and then lines up with her friends. Miss Quaver sits down and chooses some be beautiful piano music to play for the lesson. Just as the lesson is about to start, Cousin Henry appears, wearing his tiny slippers. You can follow Angelina, Miss Lily says with a smile, and the piano music begins. Stretch and bend and touch your toes. Miss Lily shows her students how to warm up their muscles with exercises. Angelina can touch her toes quite easily, but Henry still has trouble getting around his tummy. Angelina stretches her leg her legs and turns out her feet. Can you hold very still like Angelina? Alice stretches to the ceiling, then touches her toes. How high can you reach? Alice and Angelina link their hands and touch their feet. Then they rock back and forth to stretch with their muscles. Try this with a friend. Flora does a split and points her toes. How far can you stretch your leg? Felicity arches her back and stretches her arms. Can you bend back as far as Felicity? Miss Lily claps her hands. Now take your places at the bar with back straight and heads up. Angelina and her friends hold the bar tightly and lift their legs higher and higher until they can do beautiful air baths just like Miss Lily. Henry taught Henry tries to copy Angelina as he checks the, the position in the mirror, but he can't quite reach the bar. All the dancers practice ballet positions together. First, second, third, fourth, and fifth, repeats Miss Holy. Angelina holds her arms above her head and balances in fifth position. Very good, Miss Holy encourages everyone. Henry gets confused, so Angelina helps him to cross his feet and stand very still. First position, second position, third position, fourth position, and fifth position. Now we'll take turns practicing leaps, Miss Lily says with a smile. Angelina is first in line. She loves to leap as high as she can. She feels as, as if she's flying across the room. All the other dancers take their turns. Henry runs to keep up with them, then does his own funny jump. Bravo, Miss Lily applauds. Point your toes and pirouette, Miss Lily says. The ballerinas follow her as she spins gracefully around the room. Angelina starts his whirl very fast and accidentally bumps into Alice. Henry gets so dizzy he has to sit down for a minute. Sometimes pirouettes can be difficult. Pirouette is like a twirl, and you like have to look at the same spot for every time you turn around. Miss Lily is very pleased with her ballet students. Soon, we'll give her a saddle for all the parents, she announces proudly. Angelina and Alice are going to be the sunflower princesses. They, then, they try on their flower costumes and dance in front of the mirrors. Henry buzzes after them, pretending to be a busy bee. Felici does a sideways leap called a pas de sa. Pas de sa means cat step. Can you step like a cat too? Four does a graceful pirouette. When she spins in a circle, she holds her head still. Can you pirouette like Flora? 
Henry practices a plie. He bends his knees lower and lower and tries not to wobble. Try to bend down like Henry, but don't wobble. Angelina practices a grand jet, a grand jeté. She loves to be very high with her legs outstretched in the air. Can you leap as high as Angelina? Alice could do a lovely arabesque. Basque. She balances on her tiptoe and lifts one leg straight behind her. If you can stand on a tiptoe, you could do an arabesque too. All together now, listen to the music as we dance, Miss Roy says. She helps Angelina and her friends rehearse the movements for the Sunflower Ballet until they know every step by heart. Henry can't remember his steps, so Angelina helps him by dancing like a bee too. When class is over, Angelina and the other ballerinas perform a uh, Ray Veyrons. This is a way to say thank you and goodbye to Miss Roy. Angelina does an e elegant curtsy and Henry does a formal bow. Goodbye, Miss Roy. Miss Roy waves to everyone. See you next week. Angelina smiles. She could hardly wait to dance again with her friends at Miss Roy's ballet school. I hope you enjoyed the book, Angelina's Ballet Class.